Hi guys, welcome back for another video. I hope you're all having a wonderful day or night wherever you are in the world. Today's video is another Birchbox unboxing. This is what the box looks like this month. It's got some confetti going on and then there's a bunch of writing on the bottom. Um, it's pretty cute. Um, I have a bit of a story, so let's do this thing. First of all, I am quite confused because I swear I unsubscribed from uh, Birchbox last month. Um, I did not get, I, I usually get my box at the beginning of the month, like the, within the first week. And in August, I did not get my box within the first week, so I was kind of confused and I was like, okay, um, I don't know where my box is, but maybe I should just unsubscribe anyway. So I unsubscribed, or I think I did. <laughs> And then I didn't get a box all through the month of August, and then all of a sudden I got a box, like, just the other day in September. So I'm kind of confused. I have to go online and check out what's going on with my account, but I was really happy to get this in the mail because I kind of missed it. But, um, this is my September birch box, I'm guessing? I think it's September. So let's open this bad boy up. I have opened it already, but fish posh. Who cares? <laughs> this is what the box looks like um apparently this month is about multitasking so they tried to pick out products that serve more than one purpose but anyways so the first thing that i got is this momo shampoo this is from the brand daviness i think that's how you pronounce it um so this is called the momo shampoo it is a moisturizing shampoo for dry or dehydrated hair with yellow melon extract. It smells pretty good. It doesn't really have much of a smell to it. Um, I did receive in the last box that I got something just like this. It's the exact same thing except it's their um, hydrating version or something. I don't know. It's the same exact thing, just they're a different version. And it also comes with the conditioner for that. So, I'm defi definitely looking forward to trying these out. Next, I got this Nux, Nuxy? I don't know. Rev de Mille Face Cleansing and Makeup Removing Gel. Soothes and softens. So, this is like one of those cleansers that also takes off your makeup. Um, I like things like that. I, I hate having to do multiple steps to clean my face and get the makeup off. I like to just do everything in one go. Hmm. This kind of smells like, it almost smells kind of like medicinal. I don't know. Excited to try that. Um, next I got this Balance Me Tinted Wonder Eye Cream with light reflecting particles, all skin types, 99% natural. Um, so this is a eye cream that kind of doubles as a eye brightening type of thing. Uh, you could probably put this underneath your makeup, whatever you're wearing that day. It's kind of cute. I personally, I don't feel like I have much of a problem with like my under eyes, at least not right now. I'm still pretty young. Um, but this would be fun to use. I'm all for brighten up, brightening up the face. And then I got a perfume sample. This is called the Taka, Toka, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Perfume in the scent Florence. I believe this is called, yes. The scent Florence. This is what the actual perfume sample is if you guys are curious to see like what the size is. It's just this tiny little tube. Um, I'm kind of like, I don't really like these samples because they don't have like a little sprayer and when I open it up it just kind of gets really messy. But anyways, this scent says a Parisian beauty and sophisticate Florence conjures memories of old world Paris with the alluring combination of Italian bergamot and crushed violet petals. Blue iris and blonde wood add a sophisticated and feminine warmth to the fragrance. That sounds really nice. I think that's something that I would like. I haven't smelled it yet, but I don't want to open it up because, like I said, it gets kind of messy. Um, the last thing is from Milk Makeup. I'm sure some of you 
have heard of this brand. Um, a lot of people are talking about it on YouTube, the brand Milk. This is their highlighter. So, if you take the cap off, I am just a mess. Organize yourself, Sam. So, if you take the cap off, this is what it looks like. It kind of like, it twists up like this. And I'm assuming you can either just dab this on your cheeks like that, or you could also use your finger or a brush. Um, let's see what it says. It says the Milk Makeup Highlighter. Sweep on this flattering highlighter wherever you need a subtle dewy sheen and a boost of hydration from mango butter, peach nectar, and avocado oils. So that, that sounds like really healthy for your skin. The phone size is $24. Um, that's kind of expansive. Honestly, I probably won't even use the whole thing of this sample size. So yeah, I mean, that's exciting. I like when they put, like, actual name brands in here. So that is everything I got in my brush box this month. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like this video if you enjoyed it or found it helpful. And make sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified every time I put up something new. I upload new videos every single week, so be on the lookout for those. And until my next video, I will see you guys soon. Bye, guys. Make sure to give it a like if you enjoyed it or found it helpful, and make sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified every time I put up something new. I upload new videos every Monday. Why do I keep doing that? I'm like...